All right, there goes my duck. What we're doing is, is we're looking at uh, we're looking at this. All right, now look, where I had these ducks, there was like a little bitty, like a little water hole that I'd always keep flushed out in the scents. But what I had learned over the course with them, see, all this in here is a product of what they've ate and shit out and then mixed with whatever dirt that I have here. But this shit right here is literally like fucking like waterproof. I mean, it is. This ain't, this is, it's fertilizer is all it is. And I'm just saying, this is what I've done. Get in there, buddy. Because I've been experimenting with different stuff. Because I don't want to put a pond thing in there. So, but what I've done, hey, buddy. I've, what I've done is put some chunks of that right there and there. And right there and some down here in this deeper end and as it has slowly spread out i've tried to get the damn duck in there and it just won't stay in there because it grew up not in that it grew up in that it's just like humans they can't get out from under the neath in front of the tv it's the same shit but anyways this is this is what's fucked up what i've learned is, is this just by me throwing them chunks in in certain places it's fucking holding the water more so now what I'm going to do is get up because it's dry and all I have to do is just sort of remix it. And so what I'm going to do is clean all this up, clean that up, and I'm going to get that duck fertilizer shit and then mix it. And, and I'm going to rub it all the way down, all the way around it and see what happens. Because, I mean, listen, it has fucking been dry here, dude. I'm talking about dry. Look how dry it is. I mean, look at this. You know what I mean? Everything's just brown and cracking. And we've literally been able to keep that in there. Now, I have to add water, but not a lot. Because this end down here is deep. I dug it deeper. You know, because eventually I want to put, just like I have lined up here, you know, because I'm creating my own field. Because we built all this that I'm standing on, but they melted. And so I'm gonna line all that with some stone. I might use some of these, but what I'm doing is, is, <clears throat> you know, you gotta bust this shit up. You can't carry that. I mean, look at my foot. Hell, one of them weighs 80 pounds. So I'm putting them back together in pieces. And like that one's the same, that one is. You can see the tops of them, see? And once I put them all back together, this is just an outline. Check that out. Look how melted that is. Anyways. Anyways. Because I want to do this natural. So if, if you know of anything, you know, that helps uh, act as a, a, a liner is basically what it is. This will look cool, though, once I get done with it. There's my little pear tree, my chamomile, and my dill over there. I got my cypress, some basil, some chamomile, fixing the harvest. And I don't know, dude. Look, the other day, there's all kinds of life forms out here. Look at that big old rip, chunk of brick melted that's all magnetic. But there's a fucking, I swear it was an Asian hornet. It was that big. Its damn tail was as big as my thumb. And it had them, it had stripes on it. And man, it looked like if it hit you, it'd fucking hurt. And come to think about it, do they live in something like, like that? Like that right there? Because that could be it. I don't know. Fuck it, I don't care. I was like, look man, I ain't gonna hurt you, just don't hurt me. So... With all that little bit being said, I'm just trying to show you some shit because this might motivate you. I don't know. I mean, it's nothing to the world, but it's everything. Anybody that comes over here is like, did you move all this shit over here? It's like, yeah, who else the fuck was going to do it? Y'all too busy eating out and fucking off with your life. There's another good one. You see what I mean? We could even do this. This is what I do know. I can go to places, and once I see something... 
there's going to be the same melt on certain ones. That melt's different than that one and this one and this one once you combine them. And what we could do is, is around here, is, uh, fuck, get 20,000 pounds worth of the shit. And then uh, it has to be the same, you know, because people get, they pay big money for stonework. You know, and I'm just saying we can make fucking sidewall. I mean, anything. I, I'm just being innovative right now. Look at that one. Do you see how it's just all blue? And see even that one. So those go together. And then some of these that are fucking bubbling go together. So, Lala, why ain't you out here? And I tried to put some stuff in there and just fix something up so just you know a little rednecky white trashy which it's not giving my little critters some shit to do you know what i'm saying but look before i go i want to show you this this one right here oh my back's look at that i mean that that's all pieces all this right here can just go right back together watch this there it goes that's too heavy it's broken off now but those were individual pieces to structure melted squeezed together right there is where it's dripping you can see all of it that's what i'm saying look at that all those are layers of structure that I'm making my own fucking magnetic field with. And I'm gonna be able to get in that shit eventually and just soak up the charged water each day. While they say he fucking cray cray, I love you.